what he told us in March 24th concerning the country of Malawi and who he God has ordained as the president has come to pass. Is that correct? So we have a new president in Malawi and it was thought says the Lord. Celebrate this God here. Celebrate him. Celebrate Jesus who blessed you. Oh, your Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So this morning, I want to use this opportunity to congratulate the president-elect of Malawi, His Excellency uh, President Motarika, I think Peter Atto, I hope I pronounced it well. I want to say congratulations to you. It's our, it's our way here. When the Lord speaks to us about any nation, when it comes to pass, we congratulate the president. So, Your Excellency, I want to congratulate you for your victory. I think last week, it was ordained. Uh, I want to say one thing. You know, in our prayer line, I've been receiving a lot of text messages through our WhatsApp prayer line uh, by so many people from your country, Malawi. A lot are so much bitter. A lot who didn't support you and not happy. Some people believe the election was not free and fair. Some people say so many things. And I understand. But there is one thing I picked up that I want to advise you from my advice to you, Mr. President, is this. The best advisors you can have in this regime of your five years is those who criticize you. Those who criticize you are your best advisors. I want you to, by the grace of God on your life, run an inclusive government and listen to the critics. The area they believe you're not doing well, when you listen to that, you will look at where the weak points are coming and deal with it. Before you know it, you will begin to work as one of the best presidents in your country. But it is our responsibility here as men of God to pray for you. And because God has revealed things about that country without me knowing anybody or knowing you or anybody, I want to say to you by the grace of the Almighty God that we are going to be praying for you. And you know, when we gave that prophecy of who will be the next president of your country, we equally spoke concerning your health which I will not want to discuss now. I know the cameras are everywhere. I don't want to discuss it, but you know what I'm talking about. I want you to pray. Let great men of God pray for you. And I will probably be praying for you. I want to ask you to please carry everybody along. And I pray for peace in Malawi. I pray for the goodness and greatness of God in the, in the Malawi. Uh, I got a text from Malawi that there is killings in some parts of the country. I don't know if it is true, but I want to ask you if there is something like that put every effort and deal with insecurity and I pray the Lord shall bless you. Once again I want to say congratulations to you and may the Lord bless you in Jesus name. Amen and the church will say Amen.